take a ride in the helicopter simulator. We have uh, our new Coast Guard simulator. It's used for helicopter training. So this is the Bell 412 helicopter configuration. And we have what's called a cyclic and a collective. And they're what's used to move the helicopter up and down to make it go forwards, backwards, left and right. Maintenant, on va passer au deuxième simulateur, l'appareil Bell 429. C'est la partie du poste de pilotage, le module qui est interchangeable, jusque derrière les sièges des pilotes. Donc, il n'y aura aucune motion et vibration avec les deux écrans de télévision. The purpose of these simulators is to immerse the pilot as much as possible into what they would be experiencing in real life. Les tâches pour les pilotes d'hélicoptères de la garde côtière, surveillance patrouille des glaces, transfert de personnel et d'équipement, entretien pour les aides de la navigation maritime, ainsi que le, tout l'équipement de télécommunication. L'avantage d'avoir les deux plateformes, ça nous permet de faire l'entraînement sur deux types d'hélicoptères. It's very cost-effective way of training the pilots. RPM's at 103 and we're ready for takeoff. It's a good partnership. The aircraft and the simulator owned by Coast Guard and Transport Canada maintains the aircraft but also the simulator and will be providing the training in Ottawa. So now our priority is going to be to land uh, as soon as possible. So we're going to go back to the ship we just took off from and we're going to land. That was a great trip, Mario. <laughs> well done.